Hi, and welcome to my tutorials on Euclid's Elements, Book 1. This video presentation is going to be on Proposition 48 of Book 1, which is basically the inverse of Pythagoras' theorem. It states that if you have a triangle where the sum of the squares on two sides equals the square of the third side, then in that case, the angle opposite the largest square will be a right angle. All right, so let's prove this. Let's take our original triangle, ABC, and draw a line perpendicular to CA, so that this is a right angle. Define a point D, such that AB is equal to AD, and connect the points D and C. Now if we look at this triangle, this is a right angle triangle, and according to Proposition 47, the sum of the squares is equal to the square of the hypotenuse. But since this length is length C, and this is length C, then the square of DA is also equal to the square of AB, and obviously this square of this line doesn't matter where you draw it. So let's redraw our squares. Now we've already established at the beginning of this that this square plus this square is equal to the square here, which is also equal to the square here. We now have that these two squares are equal, and if these two squares are equal, then the line lengths are also equal. So now we have two triangles where we have a side, side, side that are equal. And if we have two triangles with a side, side, side equal, they are equal in all respects, including the angles, which means that this angle here, A, C, A, B, is equal to C, A, D, which they are both right angles. And thus we have demonstrated that if you start with a triangle where a squared plus b squared equals c squared, that triangle is a right angle triangle. And that concludes this video presentation. To see the next presentation, just click the next button.